Grimcast Manila is a podcast of creepy stories from around the metro. I'm your scaredy cat host, Antoinette, and I love a good ghost story. In this episode, we're talking to Gabby Serenas. Gabby is a designer making gorgeous creations with proudly Filipino fabrics. She focuses on piña and hand embroidery of Filipino flora and fauna. She loves RuPaul's Drag Race and is an avid fan of Trixie and Katya. A foodie at heart, she's using the pandemic to try a lot of new things, like coming on this podcast. Welcome to the show, Gabby. Hello. Hi, Antoinette. Hello, everybody. Thanks for having me. Yeah, I'm so glad. I'm so glad to see you after forever. Yes, it's been forever. It's been like 25 years since this pandemic yes. started. I don't know about you. <laughs> it's been 25.5 years. <laughs> you know, right? <laughs> Anyway, so let's jump right into it. Um, first question is going to be a slightly different from the ones I usually ask, which is, are you interested in stuff like this? Like, you know, stuff horror? Do you like a lot of like horror type fiction movies, books? Like, what's your relationship to things that are spooky? Um, I'm a very scaredy cat. <laughs> um, but I do watch a lot of psychological um, documentaries mm-hmm. so mainly like the west me because it's more of something that's far from mm. how you grew up because it's about killing and what's so like true um, crime yeah true crime i think the spookiest one that i've seen lately would be nightcrawler mm. and burari deaths burari deaths uh, yeah that one is from india oh. it's it recently just came mm-hmm. out. Um, yeah, so I don't want to spoil it, but it's an interesting topic. But in terms of like, let's say the the mumus, uh-huh. ghosts, and whatnot, I I do my best to like not talk about uh-huh. it <laughs> because I've had firsthand experience as a child. So, um. Yeah, but um, it's a good thing I don't have any like third eye open mm-hmm. or whatnot because you know I'm I I, I get nervous mm-hmm, easily. Mm-hmm. Yes. Super, super yeah. same. Like I, I a lot of like some people who listen to the show ask me like, oh, you talk about ghost stories all the time. Don't you want to like yeah. have your third eye open para you see them? I'm like, no, po, no, thank you. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I just like being told the story, but like I don't want to yeah. see anything. Yes, I don't also want to see anything. Yeah. <laughs> So that said, you mentioned that you've had firsthand experiences. Does that mean that? You believe in ghosts? I do believe that like the supernatural, there are they're the good ones and then they're bad mm-hmm. ones. I just do my best not to disturb yeah. anybody. Um, I really just, you know, keep to myself mm-hmm. like you don't disturb it. Right. You, yeah, don't just don't. You don't provoke. <laughs> you don't like you don't provoke. You don't, don't like provoke. ask for it. <laughs> Yeah, I don't ask for it. It's um, you know, like don't disturb me. I don't disturb you. Very, like I feel, I totally agree with this approach. Like you know that there's like a lot of people who are super curious about it, who like parang want to put themselves in a situation where yeah. stuff happens, and I'm just like, yeah, super dangerous. Exactly. Like they could also be, you know, like confused yeah. you for something. And it's the same thing. Like with us, they, we could also confuse mm. them for, for something. Mm. But just um, just don't provoke them. Don't, for me at least. But there are some people who enjoy yeah, that. Yeah. But for me, because it's like you, you're nev- you never know what you're going to get. So parang, why risk yes. it? But I mean, yeah, yes. I respect people who like want to do that. I mean... Risk, risk <laughs> assessment ka dyan, bahala ka na. <laughs> yes. I want to, where's that place? Corregidor. Mm. There's, there, like, the, the, that's the last place. And that I went to that has a tour, mm. like an evening tour, mm. which I did not go to. Like, I would mm-hmm. not. I wouldn't. I just don't want to provoke. I'm interested with history right. there. Yeah. It's like history of those. But not the like. Don't provoke it. Like don't <laughs> no, provoke don't it. Don't it. go looking for it, na lang. And yeah. I remember going to Corregidor. Like I'm, I'm sure I went on a school trip or like with my family or something. And there's yeah. like that that tunnel. Yes, and that's 
creepy. It's super creepy. And even if it's like super bright and like, you know, mm-hmm. s- lunchtime outside, when you go in, it's just pitch black. And then there are parts of it's heavy. It's super heavy. And then there are like just parts of the tunnel that branch off into like complete darkness. Yes. <laughs> I think the creepy part there is that you don't know where it's going to go. Yeah. Not necessarily with the other entities, but it's more of the unknown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, super cool. Yeah. So there's a night tour pala. So it's specifically a yeah. ghost tour or something? Yeah, it was. it's a ghost tour supposedly. I'm like, no way. I'm not going to go there. Mm, pass. Yeah. Maybe I'd pass na lang. I'd pass if Unless, siguro, if we were like 50 people. <laughs> I am very chicken. Mm. Like, I, I remember because we went to 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 Hong Kong and mm. there was, it was Halloween. Pe. Mm. It was Halloween. And then it was in a amusement park mm. and they had that horror. In my house, um, whatever. Horror. The horror house. And it looks so interesting. Uh-huh. Okay, it's a family amusement park, naman, uh, eh, So okay, we tried with my sisters. My aunt was also there, and we were like freaked out that like tawa kami uh-huh. because we didn't finish. Oh, it. you didn't. We did not finish it because we were like, you know, it's good at factor, eh. And um, I think my aunt almost hit <laughs> one of the <laughs> ghosts. So okay, like we had to. Exit. So you could do that, pala. You can tell someone we're at uh, tapos na, like we're done. Yeah, 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 like not finished. So you can, you can, because it's not like you are. I mean, you paid for it, uh-huh. so you have the option to like. I don't want to. Let's go stop this. Let's stop this. Fair. I mean, it's like it's your money, so they'll be like, eh, you paid na, oh, I know. <laughs> yeah, you paid na. I mean, and and it might, you know, there might be trouble on their end if they don't let you out. Diba? Yeah, that's true. Because, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, you do believe in ghosts. And you said that you've had experiences from when you were a kid. What was mm-hmm. the first creepy thing that you remember happening to you? Um, We used to live in an old house. Mm. And, um, yeah, it's an old house. So I think I got up at like, you know, in the wee hours in the morning to pee. Mm. And the the bathroom is out of our room. So I have to exit my bedroom and go there. Mm-hmm. So anyway, I just, the door was just halfway open. And then the door has a mirror. Uh, the door mismo has the mirror. Yes. Mm-hmm. Tapos, um, from what I can see in the mirror is my mom's dressing room. Mm-hmm. So, of course, it's dark. I was peeing, you know, half asleep. Mm. I was peeing, you know, peeing in peace. <laughs> and I got up and, you know, like, you know, and then I saw this lady mm-hmm. just pass by. I could never forget it. Eh. Pass by, had curly hair and smiling and floating. What? What? <laughs> okay. Yeah, smiling and floating. Just passed by. Lang. She's wearing black. She passed by in front of you or like in the mirror? From the mirror. Uh-huh. In the mirror. Uh-huh. So, uh, yeah, from there, I shouted na. Uh-huh. And I ran and I saw a cockroach. <laughs> <laughs> so that's like the end of it. I mean. Um, and it couldn't have like, been anyone in your house. Your mom maybe. No. A lola. Because, a helper. No. No. Because it was late in the evening na. And then nobody looks like that in the house. Oh. But it's an old house. It's an old house eh. so, so you never know. Where she was smiling. She was smiling. At you? Yeah. So not looking at you. Well, it, she passed by. She passed by and smiled at me. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like. Yeah. yeah, so parang um after that incident, parang you know I'm still very jumpy, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> very jumpy and whatnot. And I think because I was a kid, mm. then eh, it's a different thing when you're a child when you you're I was I think seven years old. Uh huh. Uh-huh. So yeah, um, buta na lang after that, wala. <laughs> I wouldn't want to. I hope not. Again, I don't disturb you. Don't disturb me. So, like, when you screamed and then my flying eep, my flippies na duma. Oh, uh, my, my flying eep is pa. <laughs> I don't uh, know which is worse. I don't know which is worse. Um, but after that, I, I, syempre, my, my parents got out of their bedroom and, like, what's what is happening? happening? And I, I told them, naman, I told them, naman, pero what can you do? Diba? Did they believe you? <laughs> 
Um, they didn't say no or whatever. They just, you know, like just you, they just calmed you down. I, I, they calmed me down, mm. and then that's, that's it. That's it. And nobody that's ever it. spoke of it again. Parang ganun. No, yeah. Um, I think I haven't. I have not told the story in a while, like ages. Mm. Yeah. Uh, but I, I would, I would tell naman my sisters. Pero matagal na yon. Mm. So I don't wanna like. Nobody has asked me that except you. <laughs> <laughs> Except you, <laughs> so that's like very first hand. And but we moved houses now. Okay, so you're you're yeah. not there anymore. And Pero, when you were in that house, yeah. did anybody ever see or anybody ever experience either something similar or parang something else? Supernatural. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, um, I, I heard like the just that they have some some like my cousin mm-hmm. would ha- have like seen something but I don't want to hear it mm. so like you didn't want to get the specifics or whatever I don't want to get the specifics anymore like okay noted meron let's just I, I still have to live anymore. here let's not talk about it yes. <laughs> yeah so let's let's just yeah let's uh, well I wasn't living there anymore mm. when that happened but again it's an old house mm-hmm. an old house so it's not, it's it's not impossible, Mm-mm. you know. Yeah. So and then after that, you kind of never figured out what it was. Parang you just like, ah, uh, yeah, never I don't want to figure. It. Yeah, never mind. I don't want to figure it out. Um, uh, I'll just, you know, at that time I was like, you know, praying uh-uh. for whoever this is. Na, cause I, uh, my aunt told me na whenever she sees things like that, she would just. Pray, because mm. pray meaning to the help person or the yeah, ganon yeah. I'm not very religious, ha, but uh, why not? <laughs> why not? So you kind of just like send out a good intention and like yeah, you yeah. you find everybody needs ganon. help. Some help, yeah. Again, there are some you know, like let's say goblin. Goblin is like this traveling. Diba may traveling souls that they're confused. Okay, sorry, what goblin? Goblins are traveling goblin, souls. No, it it's a Korean drama. Ah, okay. Yeah, it's about uh, there are souls that are traveling just around, and they're confused until they meet the you know, like the one who's gonna send them to oh, either heaven or hell. Oh, Maganon. I see. Yeah. So I mean, may pinanggagalingan naman yung mga stories na ganon. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, so. I mean, there's no harm mm. with it. Like, just say uh, good intention for the people who are confused. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, yeah. And then the rest of my other stories, naman, they're, they're like, ano na second hand. That's fine. This is the only first time. Oh, but, oh, well, yeah. I'm, I'm sort of like, I'm really happy for you that that was the extent <laughs> of it. Parang, yeah, that's, okay na? That, I, ayoko okay na. Okay na. Like, let's just, like, ayoko na, ayoko na. <laughs> yun na lang, yun na lang. Oh. But okay. Um, After that, did anything else um, so not necessarily anything as direct as that. Did anything else creepy ever happen to you after that? Buti na lang, wala. Okay. <laughs> I've heard of, um, like, let's say, uh, let's say in the specific house mm-hmm. na meron. Pero ako, like, mm, wag na, wag na, wag na, mm-hmm. ayoko na. Mm-hmm. So I just really shut it out. Because mm-hmm. I, I remember one of my staff, mm-hmm. uh, one of my employees told me na mm, lahat naman ng bahay meron. Eh. Mm. Pero when you live there mm. or what not, they just go away. Ganon. Mm. So you have to, some of them are not harmful. Eh. Mm-hmm. They're not. They're, they're just, just there. Guiding. Mm. They're, good, they're just guiding. They're just there. They're not harmful. They're not gonna harm you. Mm. Yon. So for me, my thing is, is don't provoke. Mm-hmm. Don't disturb. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's it. So after that, I, w- I didn't want to find out anymore. Okay. So you mentioned that a lot of the other things that, you know, the other stories that you know of are sort of secondhand stories. Yes. Okay. What is the creepiest one for you? Which one? Okay. Secondhand. Um, when I was in high school, mm. I went to a Catholic school, and you know, like in Catholic schools, there it's it's a it's a whole situation. <laughs> it's a treasure trove. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. So I didn't experience it, but one 
classroom did there was this you know like uh, class was going on and then there was this student a okay. student a looked at student b okay. to ask for like i don't know borrow an eraser or something uh-huh. tapos pagtingin niya bugot what and you know what the bugot yeah bugot, like okay we had it so that means mamamatay ma- ma- but that's the the pamahiin that's the, 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 pamahiin. the superstition so, Yeah, so student A was just crying. Oh my gosh. Kasi, kasi yun nga, na parang, parang girl. Ayan na. Oh my. So, uh, wait, so student A and student yeah. B were both very much alive. But it's just that... Yeah, they're, they're alive. But it's just they're that alive. when student A looked at student B, wala siyang ulo. Yes, wala siyang ulo. So, okay. What happened was, you know, student A, student A was unconsolable. Uh-huh. Yes, so, siyempre, siyempre. so, what happened is, they went to the chapel, all of them, that entire class, uh-huh. to pray. Okay. Okay, since it's a Catholic school. Uh-huh. <laughs> so, apparently, in that room, there was a kid playing around. A kid. Uh-huh. The soul of the kid. Yeah, so in land, that's what I got. But the Pugut factor was you know, I think that's scary kind enough of for me. Next level. What the hell, man? Yeah, because I remember watching this film. I think it was done during the late 90s or even. But during the 90s, it was a Carlos J. Capara film. Uh-huh. It's a Lillian Velez uh-huh. or Vivian. Anyway, um, it's a Sharon Conetta film. Uh-huh. Yeah, and Donita Rose was like... Oh, wow, the, Donita Rose. The, the, the maid. Yeah, the maid. The help. Okay. Tapos she saw Sharon Bugot in that film. Because uh-huh. she was going to get murdered by... Oh. Um, uh-huh. Yeah, it's an interesting film. You know, like those... It's Carlos J. Caparas. Do you remember the title? The, uh, Lillian Velez. Are you the title? Yeah, it was a real, it's a real story. Mm-hmm. About this actress who got murdered. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I got, she got murdered. She was one of the, the big stars back then. And um, Cesar Montano Panga was part of that film. I think it's Lillian Velez or Vivian Velez. Okay. All right. We will be sure to Google that. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but it's a you know like any anything, anything bogus factor. It's it's a foretelling uh-uh. na you're gonna die. Okay, so super like okay, and and this was not in your class. This was like some other class or something. Yes, we it's in the same floor. Ah, so that's yung nakita ko with the, the everybody's in the chapel. Like, what's up? <laughs> right, meron din ako like similar story to that, eh. and we were also on the same floor. Um, yeah. Parang we were taking our exams on that floor, and so everything is quiet. We had our teacher proctor in front, and then um, I've told the story on the show before, so bear with me, listeners. <laughs> uh, mm. At the end of the hallway, sudden, so we're all taking the test, quiet, and then suddenly mm. from outside there are screams, like ah, like parang like titi ano mga yeah. girls, oh. and my teacher was actually she her reaction was. Ano ba tong mga bat? Like, what are these children doing? They're just like dicking around. Maybe they don't have a teacher. So mm-hmm. she goes out actually to like go get mad at them. And then when mm-hmm. she, uh, uh, and then parang, kami naman, we're taking the test. We don't know what's happening. She's gone mm-hmm. for a while. And she comes back and she says, it's all okay. Just keep go Like, don't mind it. Right. Just keep uh-huh. going. And then we find out later on na, um, a cla- the classroom at the very, very end of the hallway They were they were also I'm not sure if they were having class or also taking a test. Um, but then parang they started hearing a really soft cry from the back of the room. Like super, super soft, like tiny. And then like it get it started getting louder and louder and louder until it's like wails in the classroom. Like as in like lulupasay na sound. And then all of the students were like freaking out. That's why they were screaming. And then when yeah. parang I'd freak out. Yeah, dude. And then the creepy... So, I mean, that's just like the secondhand story that we got. But it's just... But when we... The next couple of days and weeks, that classroom was blocked off and all classes in that room were diverted elsewhere. So, parang... And then every day after school, we would see the teachers go out of the faculty room right. with candles and like their prayer books and then the nuns would come yeah. and they would yeah. go to that room And I think they were doing a novena or a, vig- a vigil to like yeah. pray. So we were all like, even if it's just stories, why are they doing that? And why yeah. is the classroom like off limits? 
like shit hit the fan parang ganon yeah like, i i would like i'm actually when i'm hearing it i'm already sweating why <laughs> kasi i guess i mean like i'm super scared cat talaga um so uh i'm very jumpy right 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 i'm very jumpy so buti na lang that's it and you know you guys I'll, I'll like that's it that's it <laughs> man and nobody was hurt everybody was just like you know scared parang ganun and yes, yes. yeah and they were just like screaming i from as far as i know nobody was hurt and you know it was just you know the teachers were like okay no more no more yeah. no one will come here first we'll we'll fix it <laughs> parang ganun Mm-mm. and Mm-mm. we didn't actually like find out what it was anymore cuz obviously they wouldn't tell us right so and eventually yeah. it was opened um, up again. It's parang walang nangyari. Yeah, I think it's more of like, uh, you know, like yeah, there you go. Like you you, you pray. Even if you're for me, ah, it's like mm. that's that's what I think they just need, like good intentions, like that. Parang you know, like when it's like when peop when it's people acting out, it's a cry for help. Parang ganon. So yeah, why why yeah, wouldn't yeah. it be? similar for yeah um but yeah like for me it's just if you uh may iba kasi naman na, na matapang mm. there are others that are like see what that um series that jennifer love you mm. has that was one. it the ghost whisperer yun ba yun something like mm. that na parang matapang siya <laughs> ganoon matapang ka girl like, kung kaya mo girl <laughs> ikaw bahala oh. <laughs> Yeah, um, or like six pence. Na mm. you know, Bruce Willis didn't even know. Right. So, uh, but for me, I'm not that tapang. Right. Same. So, um, let's just you know, um, I hear it. I hear the story. Um, it goes out the other ear. <laughs> the goes out the other ear. Yeah, goes out the other ear. Na Usually, after recording these episodes, I I like watching like just cartoons. Yes, I will do the same. <laughs> I'll watch like you. You. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, just uh, it's new. It's a there's a new, new series season. out. New season today, yeah, yesterday. Parang, yesterday. So I'll just watch something to get my mind off. It. Yeah. So yeah, I usually yeah. like I start watching like Cartoon Network stuff, Powerpuff Girls, like you like bright, happy colors. Yes. <laughs> yes like just to rock you to sleep. <laughs> yeah. Then one and to make you forget like with that the burari bet mm. uh that one is a bit freaky mm-hmm. why and this uh because it it's okay uh it's mass suicide uh... yeah it's mass suicide and it was a, a bit bizarre because there's those signs of forced entry mm-hmm. so why would they do mass suicide mm. sabay sabay 11 11 deaths 11 11. A mystery. So it's a it's a bizarre thing because nobody has seen it. Mm. Um so after every episode, and I only watch in the evening because mm. uh, my pro- it's a projector and my my uh mm. my only source is a projector mm. and my room is filled with windows. Oh so the best time to watch is you at know, night. evening talaga, at night. So i after that I'd watch Dynasty. <laughs> like something catty RuPaul's and Drag Race. Bed. Oh, like just to to take my mind off of it, right. but but it is, yeah. I just easily get scared. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. So I'm gonna make you recollect another thing. <laughs> <laughs> so okay. coming back, uh, sorry in advance, but um, you mentioned that. So aside from that secondhand story, were there any other secondhand stories or things that sort of just happened around you that you remember were particularly like? Creepy, spooky. Oh my God, what's that? Hmm. So far, I think because you got pasok sa isang tenga labas sa kabila. <laughs> that's the only things that those are the only things that I would remember, mm-hmm. and then the others I just buried it na lang. Right. Because it's, it's just to I don't know, but other people because they can recollect it and it's fine with them, like mm-hmm. they're at peace with it. But for me, it's like. I'd like to, you know, bury it right for now, uh, and maybe talk about it when there's sunlight. <laughs> Mga ganyan. Uh, but so far, none naman. Eh. Mm-hmm. Wala naman, or I just really don't inquire anymore. Uh-huh. 
I don't inquire anymore. Eh. Uh, before I I would like because it's you know interesting. You know, Ay, shops. Ooh. Ganyan. I mean, de ba? Like when we were children, uso yung mga Ouija board. Oh gosh. Did you? I don't know if you guys did this in high school. There was like spirit of the coin, spirit of the ballpen, spirit yeah. of the glass. I don't find the spirit of the anything. Yeah, it's a ritual. You know, like those, the craft, the film, oh, the yeah. craft. Yeah. That's like ritual, like you're, you're calling. Mm. It's something like that. Um, I don't know. I hope you guys uh, what have seen that film because it's a good cult film. It is. Um, I think it's almost canon for our upbringing. Yes. So, um... Mm, we used to do the pera buta na lang it didn't work <laughs> buta na lang it didn't work uh, but as a child you know you're you're curious right things like that pero as I eat uh. for me like what would bring me peace na lang is that I go on with my life mm-hmm. and then that's it like you just hope for the best now nobody's gonna <laughs> disturb you mm-hmm. uh, or at least you know somebody who's stronger um, who's more used to things like that would be the ones to handle it. Hmm. <laughs> Pass it Dang. on. Thanks but with no thanks. I'm just gonna like yes. be here, like do my own thing, mind my own business. Yeah, I mind my own business. Ako na lang. And, but there are some, again, that would be more comfortable with mm. you, you dealing with that mm-hmm. na, to help out. Ganyan, to help the, this. Like actively, out. no? Yeah, yeah. There are some na parang yung like it's a Casper right know? see the dad of Christina Ricci is like talking to ghosts wow uh, Christina actively. Ricci that was an old film I mean yeah but the, but the profession of the father mm. was to help ghosts to move fix on their ba? unfinished business yeah the unfinished business for you to go to the afterlife we, we, we've mentioned movies a lot do you have a favorite movie that is either talagang scary or you know one of the medyo like Casper types that you know not that bad but like also supernatural related oh man none that I've seen of lately mm. none, none that I've seen lately uh, I had all time you must like all time mm. like even from before. horror like real horror real horror or like funny fun horror. can be both you can give one of each just so our listeners okay. um, recommendation <sighs> Ha. Okay. Um uh the horror horror mm-hmm. that I would never ever watch again. Mm-hmm. There's two mm-hmm. ways. One would be what's that film? The one of Emily. Rose. Oh my god, I was gonna say the same thing. I was like so, Ah my gosh. I couldn't sleep for days. Would you wake up at three also after? Like no, I like close my eyes. Yeah, but <laughs> I close my eyes. That's like also like that was so bad. That was a good film yeah. in a way. Na yung parang it sticks by you. And um, there's that film I forgot that the the title. Eh. Pero it's like documentary style. It's not Blair Witch, okay? Documentary style, and then that the camera is like nandun lang sa bedroom. Paranormal Activity. Yes, correct. So I remember watching it in the movie house. <laughs> I don't know. Wow. But it was fun uh, because I was with friends, you know. With 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 a f- well, she's my aunt, but uh-huh. she's my age. Wow. Um, cool. Like the popcorn would like fly <laughs> off because like the shrieks are like talagang matines. I mean, that for me is like fun because <laughs> ah, ganon. But uh, I could, I will not do that now. Yeah, but I it's it's not. actually like fun when you do that. Like so horror, like watching. I miss watching movies in general in the cinema. And if it's like scary, mm. people will scream. But afterwards, people are like gonna laugh. Na parang, like oh my fun. God. Like tawang tatawahan nilang afterwards. <laughs> yeah. So it's like that. But now I avoid mm. anything that's paranormal, mm. like movies. Mm-hmm. Kanyan, I go for the. Um, horror that is ba medyo malayo mangyari mm. like let's see human centipede oh my god Ganyan. I've actually human never centipede. seen that okay it's, it's I mean I know medically what happened possible. it's medically impossible it's medi- no it's medically possible really? Kasi, yeah because they cut and they just cut and then you sew if I'm not mistaken please correct yeah me guys I, that's what I've heard of it there. parang, attach- <laughs> parang attachment lang siya to get attachment siya um uh yeah, please correct me if I'm wrong. Pero 
it could be because mm. you attach you attach the mouse to there. Yeah. <laughs> you just attach the mouse to there, and then the insides of the body naman are all connected, di ba? And so, di ba yun the yeah. last person? Yung the last person was the one who died first, parang ganun, in the chain. Ta-ta. I think the Dumaba. second. I think the sec. I'm not. I think the second. Oh gosh. Yeah, the second one because that person was connected both ways, uh, the front and the back. Grabe. Pero, yeah, it's that one is a parang horror that I can watch. Kasi parang it's so far fetched. It's so far from from our reality yeah. here. Um, yeah, like Nightcrawler, ganon. Uh-huh. You know, like murder or Ted Bundy. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's a, it's horror, pero it's so far off from our reality here. Right. It's like the worst types of horror are the ones na parang burn into your brain because like it's slightly possible like i remember yes. i watched emily rose in the cinema mm-hmm. also and i was watching with a friend and i remember half i mean that friend and i were not touchy people but during the film <laughs> our, our arms were wrapped around each other like that was done yeah um, yeah and i i remember i was watching uh parasite oh, and yeah. i did not know what to expect but because the music is so I was holding my friend while we were watching and I was closing my eyes yeah. like that. Because I, I don't know what to expect. I don't know what to... Bama maya gulating ka bigla. Yeah. Such a good movie though. Yeah. Such a good it was movie. a very good movie. Yeah. Things like that. I That's the only horror that I enjoy. Yeah. Bug. If it's so far off from your reality. But then it happens mm. to, you know, in, in the West. Yeah. Not so much here. Psycho enough. things. Not so much here. There's an article about it. Now, why doesn't it happen here often? Mm-hmm. Uh, but because in, in the West, the houses are so far yeah. off from each other. Uh, the chismosas are not <laughs> chismosas. Um, yeah, and like uh, I've seen places like that. Yung parang same houses. Yeah. It's so quiet. Yeah. So it's not far off from their reality. Meanwhile, here, if you don't go out of your house for even just two or three days, the chismosa next door will be like, ano na kaya yeah. nangyari kay ano? Yeah, it's like that film, ano ba yun? Sada ko. The, the Ring? ring? Mm. Yeah, The Ring yung parang nandun lang siya and she rotted in the wheelchair, uh, not the wheelchair, the, the, the ano, rocking chair. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that one. If I'm not mistaken, it's The Ring or mm, the other one, not The Grudge. I'm not, sure. I'm not. I'm not super sure. I've seen the American versions of those because it's less scary. It's not that than, good though. Yeah, it, it's less scary than the Japanese I think, one. That's true. That's why. That's true. <laughs> that's why. So, but I want to get the gist. What's the gist of this? Uh yeah. It it was a hit back then. Oh yeah, such a big hit. Sometimes what I do when because PV likes watching horror movies, of course. So when he does, <laughs> and I'm getting freaked out, what I do is I open the Wikipedia entry and then I read the plot in look. advance so that I won't yeah. be surprised. But you know what to expect. Yeah. No? Okay. So yeah, I, I also know I also want to know what to expect. Yeah. But if it's a Japanese film, I'm for sure it's gonna be scary. So I'd look for the Western first, the mm. Western version first. I think the grudge, Joshua Jackson Bayon. <laughs> Maybe I'm not super super sure, but wait. Let me see. Joshua Jackson, the the one of the Grudge. Yeah, Shutter, 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 Shutter. Yeah, and I watched that with the Joshua Jackson version. Is Joshua Jackson? Wait, is it the person that I'm thinking? Ah, Dawson's Creek. Yeah, I was like, is Pacey? Pacey from Dawson's Creek? Yes, it's Pacey <laughs> with her. Oh my gosh. Um, so. I mean, just as a last sort of major good vibes question, what is your favorite, not horror, but like supernatural movie that's also kind of feel good? Like, I'll give you an example. Like, mine is actually Practical Magic. Oh, um, okay. Uh, okay. On top of my head right now, top of mind is Casper is very mm. cute. Very hard to Um, Like... It would be nice to have a friendly ghost. I mean, when you look at it, that that Casper is a person. Mm. Casper used to be a person, mm-hmm. pero he's confused, doesn't know what happened. Right. And he's just a kid. So I like that. 
um, craft, mm, of course, craft. For me, it's not scary, but for me, it's like, ooh, witchcraft. <laughs> Ooh, it's it was also cool and like all the black it was so fashion. cool parang, and it's not like they started out like, na parang they didn't want to hurt anybody it's more of they want to improve their lives yeah yeah like each one had an issue to deal with mm. and then they want to fix yeah. it yeah I remember yeah. and it was Robin Tooney and Feruja Balk yeah Campbell, parang, no? also yeah, Neve Campbell. Neve Campbell had that burn in their, her back. Mm-mm. These girls, they just want those things fixed. That's it. They don't want to hurt anybody. Mm-hmm. It just so happens na yung, uh, they called that M. Eh. So <laughs> they called that thing. Yeah. They called that thing and which affected everything. Yeah, and see, so. Ra- Rachel True was the, was the one with the curly hair. Classic. The one who like, Classic. Cursed the the pretty girl because she was making fun of her and was racist. But I'm gonna, I remember that. Yes, yes, that one. Yung parang, yeah, exactly. That one was. Um, it's far from reality. Yeah, so it's not scary. Gets gets, but it's like <laughs> yeah. ooh, fascinating. It's very fascinating. It's not like it's gonna. It's gonna the only creepy part there. Would be the insect. Oh yeah! I, oh my god! I hate that scene. I hate that scene so much. The one where yeah, it's coming insects. out of her sleeve, down her yeah, hand. Yeah, the insects. And, like, In, and it, it, there's cockroaches, kasi. Yeah. There's cockroaches. I don't like cockroaches, and the cockroaches are like the big ones. Uh, the hissing. The non. Yeah, the, the the non-German kind. The fear factor. Oh, the mga ganon yung mga linya linya. Oh, oh, so. <laughs> Yeah, maybe hanapin ko siya para I'm gonna like have a feel good thing. But yeah, that's it so far. It's like Casper and the Craft. Sometimes like I like cringy films then like in Human Centipede. Like, ooh. Like, bang, medyo gory. They're also medyo, uh, like, yeah, I love gory. Impossible. Slight. Yeah, the, the gorier the better. Like if, you know, I see blood and, uh, you know, there's a chainsaw. <laughs> Um, uh, a, a guilty pleasure would be House of Wax. Talaga? <laughs> guilty pleasure lang naman. Yung parang, uh, because it's, you know, like, um, tinahi yung lips. Oh, yeah. Tinahi yung lips. Tapos nun, um, may pinatay, tapos there's a wax. Boy ka, tapos <laughs> wax ka. Oh, it's so gory. I actually, like, I remember watching it, but also not paying a lot of attention. Maybe I'll read. Oh my God, this is the one yes. with Paris Hilton pala. Yes, with Paris Hilton. It's, it's, it's not, you know, like, it, it's not that. It's not top tier like, cinema. It's not top tier. It's not like human centipede na it will really stay with you. Uh-huh. But if you want some quick gore, <laughs> Like the the bloodier for me the bloodier is the better it's like it's cr- oh, like that but yeah. then it's fine it's fine you find it's, that again, it, it's far, it helps you really stress yes it you the part of Joe was like putting sorry it's a uh, I think it's season two you uh-huh. he put somebody in a to eradicate the 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 evidence mm-hmm. he put that dead person chopped them up mm-hmm. and put it in the meat grinder. Mm-hmm. That was that's very sweet perfection God. because of the of the it's the music uh-huh. the music it, together with how the the cinematography the music and how it was shot uh-huh. is pretty for, perfect. <laughs> it's gory, but pretty so, good. Sorry, this is you, right? Yeah, it's you. Um, Joe killed somebody, of course, again, mm-hmm. and he had to hide that evidence. So uh-huh. he chopped up a body and. He had to figure out how to, you know, like hide that evidence or what apart from burying the body. Sige, what's the quickest? Mm. Maybe you meet grinder. Kasi nga he, she, he was working in a restaurant. Right. Yeah. So basically, from what I've seen from the promos of the new season, it's like the girl he was stalking is now his version of Mrs. Lovett. Yeah, it's um it's I'm still in the second episode, but uh. pretty good so far. There's already <laughs> Somebody who died. Oh, but well, okay. Yeah, I, I, don't spoil I, 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 I'm not gonna spoil, but anything gory I like. Anything that's gory. Fine. Okay. Well, 
thanks so much, Gabby, for coming on. Thank you so much for like taking the time and making Ongkat your scary stories for <laughs> me. Thank you so much for inviting me. It's like, thanks for like ending it with the gory thing. So now I'm thinking about gory. Yeah. Stuff. Okay. But um, is there anything you want to share with our lovely listeners? What have you been up to? Where can they find you? Tell us. Okay, so um, if you want to see our works, you can go to www.gabbyserenas.com. It's G-A-B-B-I-E, Serenas, S-A-R-E-N-A-S.com. Or check our Instagram at Gabby Serenas PH. Awesome, awesome. And um, yeah, thank you so much for coming. I'm glad that, you know, we, you know, we, you. we're not ending on a super scary note for your peace of exactly. mind. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, I like, at least we, we ended it with like uh, something that's gory, something that I like. I, do, <laughs> I actually would have never expected that you would be into like gory. Like, this is a pleasant um, discovery for me. <laughs> As a surprise, it's, it doesn't seem that way, but I, I find it interesting. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, uh, maybe that's my own type of like horror that you, you gravitate toward to or whatnot. So I like if you have any gory films that you can recommend, mm-hmm. then that would be great uh, because I'm fresh out. Right. Uh, so if anybody's listening, if anybody has any recommendations on stuff that they like that is more in the gory spectrum, feel free to comment um, on our Facebook or when we share this post so that Gabby can see and like get all yes. of your recommendations. Yes. yes. Awesome. Yes. So thanks so much, Gabby. This has been Grimcast Manila with your host, Antoinette. You can find more episodes on Spotify, iTunes, Google Podcasts, YouTube, and everywhere you find your podcasts. You can also find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash Grimcast Manila. Thank you. Grimcast Manila is a podcast of creepy stories from around the metro and is produced, recorded, and distributed by Big Baby Studios. Find out more about our other shows on Big Baby at itsabigbaby.com or facebook.com slash bigbabystudios. See you next week. Bye. Bye.